So, this is a video I never thought I was going to make. I, I don't even know what to say. As of, uh, three weeks ago, it turns out, uh, Rebel Ice, as he was known on Twitch, deleted his channel. And made an apology video on YouTube about he, how he wants his friends back. And I have heard from other sources about the video, not just one, multiple sources, about the video and my thoughts about it. And I'm just not sure what to think. I know a lot of people are going to tell me that I shouldn't forgive him, but there's something deep inside me that wants to be the person I am. If you don't know, about seven, eight months ago, I got into a huge argument with Zach, and we broke apart for some time, and three months later, we finally apologized to each other. And that situation has kind of drawn back with Joey, or Rebel Ice, as he was previously known on Twitch. And honestly, I'm just... A part of me wants to forgive him. Because I wasn't in the right either. I assumed he DDoSed me, and I was convinced by multiple other people that he DDoSed me. We had what we thought was evidence that he was doing it. That he was sending messages to uh, my channel at all accounts. But honestly, for all I know, they could have been bots. And I feel like that I was in the wrong for even assuming he was doing it when we were really close friends. I'm just... I'm lost in myself because I'm a person to forgive. No matter what a person has done, eventually I do end up forgiving people. While some people hold grudges for years, it takes a few months for me to realize what I've done. And so, I wanted to make this video because I personally want to forgive him I want to see what... I want to hear his story on what he's going through. But I can't forgive him yet. You see, I'm going to end up leaving it to a vote. A group of people I trust, I'm going to put a vote out. If more people say that we should forgive him, then I will put the hammer down, I will unblock him on Instagram, and we will have a chalk. A, ch a chalk? We will have a talk. We will talk about it, and I'm not just going to easily forgive him. I want... I will make a list of... A treaty. A treaty. I will make a treaty. In a way. Basically... I'm going, if I do end up forgiving Joey, we're going to go over some rules. Something, some do's and don'ts. Basically, just to make sure that if the situation happens again, he will have broken contract. It's called a contract. If he breaks the contract, we will end up just back where we were. We will end up kicking him out of the group once more. Without a say, without a word, we'll just do it. So, if, if we decide that we're going to forgive him, we will make a list of, uh, rules, uh, you know, you guys know what I mean, we'll make a contract, and if Joey decides to agree with it, we will let him back in the friend group with open arms. And if he doesn't agree to it, we'll go our separate ways. And if the vote turns out that we are forgiving Joey, I will make an update to this video. And if not, 
There will be no further post for this subject. This has been... This is just a, a video with me quickly talking about how I feel. Because I'm not sure how to feel. But at the same time, my body wants to feel like I'm doing the right thing here. As what I think to be as the leader of the, the uh, group, as the leader of my group, I feel it's my responsibility to make these decisions. But I feel that I need to do it as a vote so everyone gets their share of opinions. And I know a lot of people aren't going to like this video. Yarday. Sorry, I had a nasty cough. Uh, I know a lot of people aren't going to like this video. But please, you got to understand where I'm coming from. To the people who don't like Joey, you got to understand where I'm coming from. We've known him for a long time. And I know how he is, but there's a part of me that wants to forgive him. For, because I wasn't in the right either. I assumed he was DDoSing me. Because it really felt like it. Some part of me felt like he was DDoSing me. But I, I was not in the right to assume that he did such a thing. Even though I knew he had the power. There were many other people who could have DDoSed me. Because at the time, I was playing Call of Duty. You know. And people who play Call of Duty get those players who get salty because they win and they find their channel and they cause drama so for all i know it could have been a bunch of random call of duty players but that's really all i got for now if you guys do you guys do enjoy i guess hit the like button i know i'm just talking but it just shows me that yeah, whatever. Hit the like button, hit the dislike button, I don't really care. Because this video is mainly out to the people... ...in my friend group... ...who don't know what's going on with me at the current time. So, if I make an update video, you guys know what's about to happen. And... Yeah. Thank you so much for the ones who did watch this. Because I know it's just been me rambling on for about five minutes straight. And I will talk to you all later.